The first of the two busiest days in the Olympic Park provided a huge test for the organisers of these London Games and the transport system that feeds it. There were early concerns when a vital underground train line was suspended, but the test was ultimately passed. This stadium had come to life at the start of these Olympics in a ceremony that enthralled many millions across the world. It took hard work around the clock to move director Danny Boyle's vision of Britain and prepare for the biggest athletic show on earth. And so the stage was set for tens of thousands of lucky ticket holders to make their way into the Olympic Park and into the stadium for the athletics. It's actually quite unusual for so many people to turn out for early sessions of athletics, even in the Olympic Games. But this is partly due to the feel-good factor around these Olympics. And a flurry of British gold has added to the excitement and the enjoyment of these vast crowds. Absolutely amazing, yes. We're, we're, we've been blown away by the whole thing. We've been here a whole week, not in the park, but all through the different venues. And it's outstanding. Very welcoming, very warm and, you know, basically as good as it gets in terms of having a, a nice homely feel to the place. You know, it feels everyone has a sense of belonging to the place. I, I, I really, really enjoyed it. I think amazing is an understatement. It's, like, it's been wonderful, it's been great just walking around. There's so many things happening. It's so busy, but everyone's just on a brilliant high. They're really enjoying yeah. it. It's fantastic. Have you ever yeah. experienced anything like this? No, no nothing this big. No, this is no. just, I've been to football matches in Wimbledon and stuff, but I said 200,000 people, it's just an amazing atmosphere. Those with athletics tickets were particularly looking forward to watching the woman seen as the face of these London games, heptathlete Jessica Ennis. They weren't disappointed as she surged into the lead with a record-breaking start. Before the games began, the stadium was the subject of bitter debate and dispute over its future. The matter still hasn't been settled, but that's the last thing these people were concerned about with a spectacular week of athletics to come. Lee Wellings, Al Jazeera, in the Olympic Park in London.